web development moves fast. Here's how I keep up without burning out. Next is for the fun, fast API. Five tones. Here's the best practice. This is the developer show. Let's be real. Web development moves fast, but you don't need to chase every sign thing to stay relevant. Here's how I keep up without burning out. First, I have subscribed to a handful of high-quality newsletters. I read this massive magazine and sometimes front and focus. Short, curated, no fluff. You don't need 10 inboxes full of change logs. Then I join the official Discord servers of the frameworks. Angular and Next.js both have super active official Discord servers, great for announcements, roadmap updates, and even asking questions directly to the community. Then I follow the projects on GitHub. I watch repos like FastAPI, Next.js, Angular, and some tools I use regularly just to stay up to date with major releases, tags, or discussions. Then I follow the maintainers and core teams of frameworks on Twitter or X. You will hear things there before they hit blogs, especially breaking changes or cool experiments. Last but not least, I don't read everything. I skim what matters. Maybe once a week, I scan a few sources, check GitHub release notes, and maybe test out one new tool or feature. And that's it. The goal isn't to know everything, it's to keep our radar active without frying our brain.